Hello, my name is Adani Raphael with the Avaya Service Stability Engineering Team. This video is about how to configure a custom banner on the Avaya ERS 4000. There are many reasons why you may want to configure a custom banner on the ERS 4000. As a customization, you may want to create a banner with your company's specific information, like company name and support contact information. As a good security practice, you may want to present a warning message to users that only authorized access is permitted. As communication to users, you may want to display messages on system update, configuration change, and maintenance schedule. We'll go through the following steps to configure a custom banner on the ERS 4000. First, we'll log into the system with the read write privilege using the RW user account and password. Then, we will enter the global configuration mode using the enable and conf-t commands. Then, to configure the custom banner, we'll use the command banner, line number, and then banner tags. Then to enable the custom banner, we'll use the banner custom command. Then we'll show the new custom banner using the show banner custom command. Then after that, we'll save our banner configuration using save config. Then we will log back into the system to verify the new custom banner using the RW user account and password. When you turn it to the ERS 4000, you are greeted with this startup banner. You can customize the portion of the banner where the large text Avaya is on the screen. Let's enter the command line mode with Ctrl Y. At the login screen, I'm logging into the ERS 4000 with the rewrite login privilege using the RW user and password. At the command prompt, enter the privilege exec mode by command enable. Then enter the global configuration mode by command conf t. Then configure your banner using the command banner followed by line number, then the banner text in quotation marks. You can configure up to 19 lines in the banner. So the line number can be from 1 to 19. In this case, line 4 will display property of Enterprise XYZ Inc. Then, using the same command to add another banner message on line 6 to read, only authorized access is permitted. Then, enable custom banner with command banner custom. You can display the custom banner with the command show banner custom and here is your custom banner. Let's log out. The next time you log in, your customized banner should be displayed like this. As you can see, it is a simple process to configure your custom banner on the ERS 4000. Thank you for your time today. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentor at avai.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details and other technical information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you for choosing Avaya.